Hi, my name is Shabam, and I'm part of PSURI3D, and I'm going to be going over the intake mechanism. We have a dual directional in intake, which allows us to intake from the ground, as well as outtake from it as well. So, we have two rollers. The top one is four inch comp compliant wheels, with the green squishy wheels being in the middle. Then we also have a bottom uh, one that's going in the opposite direction to intake. Without this bottom pool noodle, this would go straight down and jam. Another interesting fact is that we have a churro, as seen here, which allows it to not pop out when, when you're intaking it from the outside. We have a holder bar, holder bar where uh, we have four uh, intake, four two inch compliant wheels which are the squishy ones to easily allow it to hold it in place as well as outtake when we want to. When we do, uh, we used to have the pool noodle here, but we found that that was jamming it and causing this to squeeze and essentially rip the node. So we changed it to these four two inch compliant wheels. And then some of the challenges we had were that sometimes it would not go in through the center of the intake. So we have applied the tape to make it easier to and take it and get less jammed. In future versions, we would add two inch compliant wheels here rather than the tape, which would allow it to, for a smoother transition into the intake. Another challenge that we did occur was the, the carpet would grip onto the note so that when we were intaking it, it would get stuck if we were stationary. In order to prevent this, we start with a forward motion when we intake it, allowing it to easily and not get jammed into the intake. Thank you for listening and good luck teams.